Our recognition of Asian American and Pacific Islander Heritage Month continues tonight with the secret past of a San Jose woman. She spent decades helping her husband at his job and raising their family, but she had a remarkable life back in Saigon that she never talked about. Tonight, Claudine Wong introduces us to the woman who people are now calling Vietnam's first rock star. The drop of a needle on a decades old vinyl. And just like that, you are transported back in time through the voice of a teenage girl growing up in 1960s Saigon. I'm 12 years old and one of um, musicians in my neighbor and he teach me how to sing. By the time she was 17, Phung Tam was singing every evening at the nightclub. Now, even at 77, Tam says when she closes her eyes, she remembers. When I sing and my eyes close, and I think about, you know, that's why my feeling and my emotion. Back then, she says all anyone wanted to hear was American rock and roll. Some uh, like a swing and some blue, you know. I love Paris. Why, oh why do I love Paris? Because my love is here. But she also spent time in the recording studio. Although there, she only sang Vietnamese rock. The government, they don't accept to recording American song at that time. Only Vietnamese song. In the mid-60s, she met her husband, and she says she thought that was the end of that story. Came to U.S. is uh, 1975, yeah. the end of April. And why did you come here? Because uh, the communists took over the South Vietnam, you know. That's why I have to go. She settled in the South Bay, where she and her husband raised three children. Her oldest daughter, Hana, says there was always music in their lives. It was singing in the kitchen, at the karaoke machine, in the car, and um, over the phone. But Tam never talked about her past or the fact that she's been called Vietnam's first rock star. In fact, it wasn't until 2019 when a movie producer wanted to use what they thought was one of Tam's songs that she told Hana about her past life. I say before I am I'm singer, I have an album. Yeah. Did she believe you? I don't know. And I was like, okay. Tell me, okay, let's go back, let's rewind. Tell me all about the song and the movie and the recording. You recorded a song that they want to use? And that started me rolling and researching and emailing and spending countless hours online trying to figure out my mom's past. That's amazing. <laughs> Were you like the whole time uncovering it going, really? Yes, exactly. <laughs> More incredible was the unbelievable collection of Tam's music that had been preserved by fans from around the world. I had no idea that this group of people um, were out there salvaging pre-75 music that has been destroyed by war and neglect and um, really erasure. But those vinyls had been worn down by time. I was floored by the story. That's when Hanna found a London-based independent producer, Mark Jurgis. So Hannah reached out to me and I, I signed up immediately. I was sold. What we're lucky to have are these documents um, that help us sort of piece this fragmented puzzle of Vietnamese music and cultural history. Um, because understanding Vietnam's music history is, uh, in my opinion, still very much a work in progress. It's the story of her mother that Hana is just getting to know. I translated all of the songs it, from Vietnamese to English. She looks so country, <laughs> but she's singing Sing rock, uh, and roll. rock and roll. Mm -hmm. I like this one because you're very strong and a little bit um, mean looking. <laughs> But very sexy. 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 
a story told every time Tam closes her eyes and sings. Your arms open wide and close me inside. And every time the CD plays or this needle takes a turn. <laughs> the story of the music and the girl. You can keep a secret for like a super long time. <laughs> 55 years. <laughs> Finally, a secret no more. The world will always welcome lovers as time goes by. In San Jose, Claudine Wong, KTVU, Fox 2 News. The collection is called Magical Nights, Saigon Surf, Twist, and Soul. Her music is available on Sublime Frequencies and will ship next month. And it comes with booklets with more on that remarkable story of Fung Tam. And